right, ladies and gentlemen, now hopefully we are live on YouTube this morning for Karina Challenge 4, so we're doing O Canada, uh, and we've already started to get Sabertooth a little bit ramped up here, I've done like two fights already, but again, we still got a bit more ramp up to go, uh, and this one is to do the Labyrinth of Legends with only four star Canadian champions in your team roster, uh, so yeah, this is like very, very limited uh, to a, uh, a select group of characters. So yeah, these are all of the Canadian champions. So I believe the best option is just using um, uh, Four Star Saber 2 for the Sasquatch synergy. Uh, so yeah, we're going to dive in and give this a little bit of a go. But morning to Crazy Cow. Thank you very much for being the first person to tune in today, man. Again, I've, I've done so many uploads in the last 24 hours. I think this is like upload number eight now. <laughs> the YouTube's like, no, we're not sending out any more of your videos, bro. Relax, chill. Okay, let's let's see what we can do here. Again, we need like uh, a few more fights just to get this man ramped up. So we are, uh, yeah, just gonna get to the special three. Uh, probably get to the first enrage and then special three, and then we gotta bail out at some point. Oh yeah, I need to remember because of the guardian synergy, we actually have like a super long stun for our first um, our three parries, which is really nice. Right, let's see if there's any chance we can stand really, really still after this to get the bonus special 3 Fury. Uh, I think it's uh, somewhat limited. We'll give it a go. Yeah, that's that's just not going to happen, is it? <laughs> We're right next to him. It's like, dude, if we stood still there, we would have got clapped, mate. Okay, nice. I'm glad we got the persistent charge again. The persistent charge is like one of the biggest things here initially. I can get uh, a few more Furies this fight, so I need to try and get them where possible. Sabertooth is starting to... Uh, he's starting to do a little bit more damage now, man. It's getting better. Let's see if we get the conversion. Oh, unfortunately not. Alright, let's chuck off that. To get two more furies in this fight, man. I think we can do it. Right, if we go for this, and then as soon as this lands, uh, we'll quit out. <laughs> we should get the big fury to carry over to the next one. So yeah, hopefully this should work here. Okay, nice. Again, the, the annoying thing about this is just really getting the saber two ramped up. Um, but once we, uh, <laughs> once we really get into this run, man, I was watching, uh, Karai Mike do it yesterday. It seems, it seems like a pretty fun time, so we'll have to see. Yeah, man, he's gonna, he's definitely gonna take a little bit of a, <laughs> a little bit of a while today. I expect to be here for about three to four hours. Okay, nice.
Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, right. <laughs> and that's why we fully heal up, because we don't want to lose the, the persistent charges, man. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that was a really... Uh, could have been a much more tragic evade there. But that was, uh, that was scary enough. A Red Hulk's uh, a really annoying, like, first fight, because he's got so much resistance. This man has resistance for days. Okay, yeah, so we need to, um... I think the only way we can now, like, ramp him up is by getting, uh, special three Furies and then quitting, I think. But yeah, those ones are gonna make him hit, uh, much harder, so let's see if we can get another special three here, dude. Right, so let's go for this. That's uh, one Fury we got in hand. We get an additional one, and then we can start the next fight with 19. So, yeah, not too bad. Again, we are getting there with his uh, ramp up here. But there we go. So, that 17, we banked two. So, we start the next fight with 19 there. <laughs> but this is... I, I brought uh, another Odin this morning, man, just to make sure that we would have, uh, hopefully, plenty of resources for today's run. Uh, but it's, it's going to be a little bit a little bit expensive on the uh, the potions, man. But I, I thought Suicide Masteries was the way to go, just to make it a little bit less painful to play through. But, yeah, we'll see what's up. When is the tier list video? Um, I do need to do it soon. Maybe later today or some point this weekend. Uh, depends, like, how fired up I am after this stream to, um, uh, potentially do another challenge or not. So, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see on that one. Again, I have become a little bit distracted. I still need to... Uh, I bought the Shang-Chi bundles, but I've got to do my crystal opening as well. Uh, probably at some point today. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Should be, uh, should be a good time. Well, hopefully, anyway. Right, I think we'll go for this. Perfect, mate. Yo, what is up, Breezy? Thank you very much for the five dollars super chat, there, man. Any tips on what characters? I'll be doing like uh, probably a tier list for the um, uh, the new level ninety demon on seven DS. So yeah, keep your eye out for uh, <laughs> that on the Seven Deadly Sins channel, man. But Jericho's really good. Uh, green demon Melly's really good. Zaratros is really good. He sucks for the first phase, but the last two phases, he's amazing for. Escanor can work for that fight. Esteros very bad. Counter melee. <laughs> There's like quite a few options and strategies that you can go for. He's like a bit of a tricky fight, but a cool one. But yeah, thank you very much for the super chat, man. I certainly do appreciate it. And that makes you our blubberiest whale of the day. So we'll get you up there um, at the uh, the top of the screen in uh, just a moment. Yeah, sorry, I've been, uh, I've been big slacking on the 7 Deadly Sins uploads. I've had so much to do this week uh, with Marvel Contest of Champions. Plus, it's been a, a bit of a dead week in 7DS, so it's nice to uh, take a little bit of a break. Okay, right. I think we ride this one out for, like, one more special three. I think we can do it. We still got, like, good time on the Enrage. Because, again, one thing we do need to be uh, very wary of um, is the Enrage timer. Four star champions. This Red Hulk's uh, gonna go savage. Right, I think we'll uh, <laughs> we'll drop it at this point, man. 
it's pretty pretty good point to uh, end out with a ramp up, I think. Again, we could go on a little bit longer, but I think uh, now's a pretty good time to dip out. Just get the Furies, get them in the bag, and then, uh, yeah, go again. But anyway, let's get Brito up there as our Bobby as well. Any advice for the 5.2.5 Bane node? Thomas, I'd have a look at the Cyclops stream that we did yesterday. Uh, Bane, at least in my opinion, is just all about kind of getting used to the timing with the transfers. So it's like delaying your combos, doing shorter combos to try and like, you know, line up a really good interval um, where you can then like uh, do a longer combo and transfer over. Dude, sweetie, I watched your Kamala challenge, challenge <laughs> your Kamala challenge this morning, bro. You smashed it, mate. I was not disappointed. So yeah, massive congrats on that, man. Um, I was very impressed that you did it like itemless straight out of the gate as well. But sweetie, you're just like, you know, <laughs> as well like two years ago, man. You were way too good at this game, and now like you're just you're just stupid, bro. You're just stupid. Can you just get worse, man? <laughs> you're making all of us feel bad about our skills over here. <laughs> so yeah, dude. But yeah, massive congrats, man. You smashed it, mate. Okay, nice. We're on 21 uh, Snacks of Fury now. But yeah, I'm, I'm excited, uh, sweetheart. I feel like, um, you know, you did zero revives. I'm going to try and do under 100 revives. That's my goal <laughs> for the Kamala Khan challenge. Uh, I was like, dude, I'm going to just gonna get my ass handed to me. But it should be a fun stream. Please play with Doom and Six Star Aegon. Uh, I don't think you understand the point of the Karina challenges, my friend. <laughs> uh, the point is that we, we can't play those characters because we've got to play with other, other characters, man. We've got to play with the Canadians today. But uh, yeah, thank you uh, for tuning in, dude. I appreciate it. But now Sabretooth is uh, decently ramped up. He's feeling so much better to play. And again, this fight's annoying because if we don't... Um, crit? And yeah, you don't really do any damage. Oh! No! <laughs> okay, I got murdered. I still got my charge out of that fight, though. Uh, so it doesn't matter too much. I actually think as well, <laughs> we got one Fury there, uh, which is okay. But yeah, I just, I let my guard down a little bit. One second, I'm just also going to turn up the uh, the brightness on my phone. It's a little bit, a little bit dark here. Right, let's go back to this. Got a map of uh, a trampoline park there, man. That's a very old um, uh, memory on my phone. That's the... <laughs> Designs for one of our older parks. Uh, right, let's go for um, uh, yeah, let's let's jump in again. Right, nice. Okay, I think if we're lucky, we can get him down with this one. Because we're also about to go into Assassin's range as well. And then in comparison, um, both, what is it, Old Man Logan and Electra and Captain Marvel actually should be a lot easier. And then I think Unstoppable Colossus is going to be a bit of a pain.
Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Yes. Just got out of that. <laughs> right, we can do this, man. Come on. Oh no, dude! That's really, really unfortunate. Um, hmm. I'm trying to figure out if I can get. I actually don't think it's the right idea to go in with Sabertooth now, because if I can't get the special three for the finish, um, then yeah, I'm a little bit screwed because I need to keep on getting persistent charges. We actually think we just finish here with Wolverine, man. Should be good anyway. Oh, that that babe was just unfortunate, man. But that's that's just Labyrinth of Legends for you. It's gonna be like that friggin' Black Widow. <laughs> There's gonna be a few salty evades today, and we just got we just gotta be ready for it, boys. We gotta embrace the embrace the salty evades. Wolverine is, he's, he's going to have here though for the finish. I actually don't even have deep wounds on uh, with this mastery set up. I don't think I really need it that much. But uh, yeah, that was, uh, that was good, man. That was good. Right, let's move on to our, our next opponent then. Okay, so Sabertooth is, he's decently ramped. He's not fully ramped yet. We can still get a fair bit more attack out of this man. Right. Let's go for, um... The revive here, fully heal this man up, and then see what we can do. I think again, I'm not really opposed to quickly using like 10k potions today if needed. Um, right, is there anything I'm not considering? No, I think we should be good. Oh, I'm not looking forward to that magic fight, dude. That magic fight is going to be a goddamn salt fiesta. Double evade, bro. This <laughs> this old man Logan thinking he's Spider-Man. <laughs> okay, I'm very lucky he didn't punish us there, though. That's fantastic. Nice, let's get that persistent charge. And then already it's feeling so much better in terms of the damage now. Because we don't need to deal with his massive physical resistance. And then next fight we actually have class advantage, which is a godsend. Might as well go for a cheeky one of these. Why not? But yeah, from this challenge... Oh, dude, yes, yeah, six-star Nexus Crystal. If we could get Doctor Doom or Torch from this, man, that'd be like the most well-earned <laughs> Demon Torch ever. I would love that. But uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens.
Oh, damn it, dude. Yeah. It's a little bit unlucky with the punishment there. Uh, <laughs> it, it still wasn't a bad rally. Again, we could be going for like more uh, special threes and then dipping out a bit earlier. But yeah, I was just trying to be greedy there. See if we could... Um, uh, what is it? Getting down to 50%. We weren't, weren't too far off. Again, if he hadn't punished there, man, we would have been in a pretty good spot. But yeah, it is what it is. I have a 5-star rank for Aegon. Can I do Labyrinth with less items spent? I wouldn't bother with Labyrinth, dude, and 2. Take that Aegon up to um, a rank 5. But can you do it with a rank 4? Uh, definitely. But uh, honestly, dude, just wait until you rank 5 Aegon. Like, focus on something different, like a variant or a little bit of Act 6. Because, yeah, it's just going to be even cheaper and much easier to do if you do have that rank 5 Aegon. So that would be uh, my advice for you there, mate. Just take a bit more advantage of the stuns at the uh, beginning of the match. <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize I was unblockable there. Again, the uh, the old man Logan synergy can be uh, quite clutch. Save the teeth. Right, let's go for this. I think once we got them fully ramped up, we should be able to take most bosses down. If we get a really good run in one or a five, it's going to probably be one or two revives most bosses. I think uh, I saw Cry Mike did it. I think it's like 28 revives, something like that. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to do it in 28 revives, dude. Oh, uh, yeah. Under under fifty, bro, would be great, but we'll uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I just wasn't um, uh, quick enough on that dash back there, man. I was trying to figure out like whether or not I should cash out and go for the special three, but yeah. Oh, mate. Right. Uh, let's let's revive up and go again. It wasn't a bad run, though, dude. Pretty decent chunk there. Yo, what's up, Alvaro? Thank you very much for the $5 super champ. My favorite champion, dude. Um, hmm. Well, right now, <laughs> it's probably Shang-Chi. <laughs> like, Shang-Chi is just a beast. So, yeah, right now, I'm on a bit of, bit of a Shang-Chi wave. But, uh, yeah, again, my favorite champion, dude, it literally varies from month to month. Sometimes, you know, you play a champion loads, and then you just get a little bit burned out and want to play somebody a little bit different. Oh, okay, we were we were quick enough to respond to that evade. <laughs> nice. That's the 
decent, man. That's decent. Right, let's chuck in a five combo. <gasps> no! Oh, please, dude, please don't. Please don't combo me. Please, 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 please. Oh, my God. Oh. Right, evade straight into stun, dude. Wow. I was worried I was going to lose one of my persistent charges already. Again, this is not the time I want to be losing them. Oh, okay. Thank goodness for that. That is, uh... It's alright. We might still be able to finish this man off here. And we are regenerating a bit. Okay, nice. Let's go. Sabertooth Awakened Ability. Definitely shat my pants there a bit, boys. <laughs> oh, we're... We're back in action, lads. We're back in action. Right, I think that should be enough now. Come on. Okay, perfect, mate. Perfect. Right, and then we get the uh, additional Mega Fury there, which is really, really good. But, yeah, very happy to see that. It's 2 a.m. in my time zone. Dude, I've already been sleeping, Dylan, mate. I've had a good, uh, I think about... um. Uh, six and a half, seven hours. Not the best night's sleep, but I, <laughs> I woke up, like, so excited for today. <laughs> so, yeah, I uh, I was buzzing, mate. I was buzzing. I was like, yes, we got so much content to do. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I, I just love it when I'm just, like, stupidly busy. Those are the times where I just, uh, I'm thriving, boys. So, yeah, we'll always enjoy a busy day. And then we're going to go straight from, like, a crazy weekend of MCOC... Um, oh no, I just realized here, because we've got the Suicide Masteries, we do have the uh, Ability Accuracy Reduction on Electra. She's got that on us, sorry. So yeah, that's going to make this a bit more annoying. Still do it though, we've got some mega damage here. Should still allow us. Yeah, we still got the charges here. It's just defensive ability accuracy reduction. So yeah, parry's uh, not really going to work on this fight.
Right, about to hit the uh, <laughs> the rage. I think we cash out at this point. That was uh, that was a great first try though, dude. That was really really nice. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, <laughs> fifty five percent, dude. No parries as well. That was that was dope, bro. Oh, right. That's fantastic. Yeah, I, I agree with Sweeter, dude. The Labyrinth challenges, like the other ones, I think are much more fun in comparison to the Labyrinth ones. Because all the other ones, I guess the, the Cyclops one is a bit, oh god, it's a bit BS on the uh, collector. Um, but yeah, I think the other five are all <laughs> quite fun and skill-based for the most part. Unless I'm considering one that isn't, but yeah, there's a lot of good ones, man. Uh, but yeah, the Labyrinth ones, maybe not so much, but hopefully they can uh, learn from this, like, first iteration, what people really enjoy and what people uh, don't. So anyway, let's uh, let's get ready to dive back in. I think as well, let's, like, heal Sabertooth up fully here, because we're going to try and go for the KO if we can. But come on, lads, let, let's see what we can do. Unblockable synergy is clutch, man. Right, that should be a nice push there. If we can finish this fight with a special three as well, dude, we're going to be hitting so hard on the next fight. We're in pretty, pretty damn hard here in all fairness, man. <laughs> go, go really nicely. I'm just saying, boys, there's levels. I probably should have gone for some special twos in all fairness, man, thinking about it. I think we should be fine, though. As long as we play aggressively, we still got plenty of time before the uh, Enrage. Or the hard Enrage. We're also about to enter Assassin's Range, which is fantastic. Get a little bit more damage as our health dips below 50%. Just gonna throw this one out to the chat. What do you what way do you think we should go? Colossus or Vision and Spider Gwen and Cyclops? I think Colossus is the much better way to go, unless I'm not considering anything, right? But yeah, chat, let me know your thoughts on that and let me know if I'm um not properly considering anything in that equation. Oh no! <laughs> I thought I had like uh, one more hit. Special three was gonna be. I should have just gone for special three there, man. Uh, ah well, it is what it is. We still got plenty of damage at the moment. 
Because again, I hit from 2% to 1%, so I was like, oh, if I can go one more hit, then special 3, it should be perfect, just to make sure we can get the opponent down. But yeah, I didn't really need to do that. I think special 3 would have been fine. Um, uh, but anyway, we got uh, Cat Marvel up next. Let's go for it. I want to revive on that fight, though. Pretty good. I'll happily take that. Definitely going to be uh, rinsing a uh, <laughs> little, bit, little bit on the potions there. Yeah, Colossus. I think Colossus is the way to go, boys. Thanks for the uh, the reassurance there, man. It's all good. We can still get like that special three fury at a later point. I'll probably get both of them on this fight, actually, if we do play it nicely. I just need to look a bit closer at that special three damage. But now we got so much base fury again. That was just a stupid play. I should have just gone for it. So yeah, small mistake, but we'll, we'll stay in the zone. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I'm so lucky we had that special three there. She evaded straight into blocking me. Um, okay, nice. So we, we got our persistent charge now. So that's, that's kind of the main thing we need from like every single fight. Because again, if we have some bad spots, which ultimately we will, maybe a, maybe around magic we can't get a special three before we die um then yeah we are gonna not be in very good shape but i am uh i'm not too excited about that magic fight man <laughs> i must admit <laughs> magic's gonna be uh, a bit of a pain let's see if we can like get 50 percent here Yeah, we're looking on good track for 50%, as long as I don't get absolutely mashed. Oh, uh, let's go. No, <laughs> no. I was so close to special three. Damn it, bro. Damn it. Oh, mate. It doesn't matter. We're like three Furies away from full ramp up anyway, but that was still good. That was still really, really good. Oh, right. Fantastic, boys. I, I actually do have Guardian on the team, by the way. Sorry, my head's, my head's in the way, just to show you. Hey, there we go. We do have Guardian for the um, uh, the synergy, but he's not leveled up. Uh, so yeah, just as a heads up there. <laughs> but anyway, let's revive up. Let's jump back in, boys. Uh, so yeah, we, we do have Guardian. Don't worry. Of course, got, we got got to bring Guardian for the block proficiency, man. Like uh, you know, you can't you can't pass up a synergy that good. 
Um, okay, I've got 11 minutes left on my 30% booster. Oh god, we've been live for like 40 minutes already. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're getting cushioned in today, man. I've got so many, like, level 2 health potions, it's ridiculous. So I'm going to use, like, a few of these, just get Saber Tooth topped up. So, yeah. Is this a tier list? It's a weird-looking tier list, if it is. <laughs> but, yeah, my tier list, uh, probably be out, like, sometime this weekend. Maybe later today. Probably this, I'll set expectations, probably some point later this weekend, um... Uh, if not Monday, but again, there's just so much content to do. Why suicides? Just to make like the experience quicker and less pain, uh, less painful, dude. I think to a certain extent, um, it kind of balances itself out a little bit as well. Because again, with suicides, you can get uh, the fights down in um, one revive if you play really well. And revives are, for, I would say, a fair amount of players, more scarce resource in comparison to potions, which you can technically also farm infinitely. But yeah, on this channel, we kind of big little at Wayland, so, <laughs> you know, it, it just doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm not worried about being, like, super cost-effective. I just want to get it done, bro. want to get it done uh, as quick as possible and, ideally, as easy as possible. So yeah, that's what we're looking for. And even if I, um, what was it, w with Sabertooth, like, even if I wasn't running suicides, I'd still heal up. And the problem, like, really isn't dying from suicides. But you want to make sure you're healed up anyway, because if you do take a combo, like, if the opponent evades, and we saw an old man Logan, he evaded, like, straight away into a combo. And if you're not healed up, then, you, you know, scenarios like that are going to cost you your persistent charges. And that is not going to be a great time. And if you lose those again, ramping up Sabertooth. Oh my god, dude, 37k! Go off, King! Let's go! That was fantastic, man. Yeah, that was, that was, wow. <laughs> There's something about Sabertooth as well. I think he's got the same animations as, like, Stark Spidey, right? I think. <laughs> or similar animations. So much fun to play. Oh, I should have just saved Special 3 there, because this this might be a bit too much damage now. Okay, now that was the right play to go for. going to be enough. I hope it is, dude. I really hope it is. Okay, yeah, nice. Even 2% we can snipe, so that's really, really good to know. Um, but in all fairness, I think we only need, like, one more special 3, and then we are uh, pretty much done on the ramp up, so that's a good time. And let's uh, move on. We definitely want to avoid the uh, abomination here, so let's not go toward him. And then we got Unstoppable Colossus. Unstoppable Colossus is going to be a bit of a pain. Oh, we're getting Ambush first. Okay. Um, I think for the Ambush fight... Um, do we still use... I think we still use Sabertooth here. Yeah, we got time to um, get to a special 3 to offset the uh, persistent charge. So, yeah, as long as we don't mess up. Does this, this guy doesn't have Unstoppable, right? But he's just got Juggernaut's animations. Um, I think, anyway... So yeah, he's just got... You don't want to get hit by the special attacks. <laughs> uh, and all attacks have a chance to stun. So yeah. Uh, I remember this guy. I think bulldozed me once. Because uh, it bulldozed me probably a fair few times when I was initially doing this uh, a few years ago. God, it's like almost five years ago. <laughs> Four and a half, five years ago that we did Labyrinth for the first time. Damn, man. That feels like a lifetime ago.
I don't think this man has a special three. Also, like, I don't want to... <laughs> I'm, like, 99% sure he has no special three. <laughs> but I don't want to risk it until I got a persistent charge. Okay, nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm like, 99% sure there's no special three on this man. So I think we can. We can just be aggressive. Let's just get Billy in. And hopefully he doesn't whip out some sort of crazy one. Yeah, we're chilling, man. We're chilling. Just got Juggernaut specials, so he kind of just headbutts forward. Slams the ground. I always, like, thought these are uh, pretty pretty cool addition to uh, Labyrinth. It would have been nice to see some of these in Abyss. Maybe, like, six star, uh, six stones. That would have been cool, man. Oh, actually, I should have just gone for a special three. That nah, doesn't really matter too much here. Right, let's just go for that. Yeah, I want to try and avoid getting the uh, the base fury as the last one and try and get special three fury as it. Um, right, unstoppable colossus time. Let's uh, dive into this, man. Yo, MCOC Rube, it does make you the blubberiest well of the day. So thank you very much for the super chat, man. Certainly do appreciate it. And thanks for the uh, the six dollar super chat. What's that? The perfect. Parry block is, uh, yeah, from like a mixture of Guardian Synergy. It's just Guardian Synergies, really. Because Guardian Synergies OP, dude. They're really, really good. Right. Um, I'm not too sure how much damage we can uh, uh, deal here. This might take like uh, two, three revives to get down. We've also got the Unstoppable in play as well, which is super annoying. So yeah, actually, maybe four or five revives uh, thinking about this fight. This is always like, I remember doing the easy path back in the day. Always one where we'd hit a little bit of uh, a little bit of turbulence here. God, that Unstoppable was mad long. The worst thing is, like, ramping up Star-Lord on this one, man. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that Star-Lord run, man, is going to be is gonna be brutal. Got no friggin' synergies you can bring alongside uh, the boy as well. Come on, fella. Let's go. Fantastic. We'll dump the, uh, the special three here. Hopefully he goes straight into special one, then we can just wait that out and then start murdering him. But this gives us our persistent charge back. Any reason why I don't convert the active into passive? Just because we can't above 15. So yeah, you see we're at 29 at the moment. So yeah, it just it doesn't work. Above 15. So the only way that you can um, get additional furies above 15 with the Sasquatch synergy is via special three. Uh, or ending any fight with a Fury. And then they only uh, stack up to 30. Let's go for a cheeky backdraft here. Slam in. I think if you're really quick, you can get a cheeky medium attack after that special too. <laughs> but yeah, you got to be super quick, dude. Ugh, I'm pretty much out of parries. Uh... So yeah, we just got intercepts ready. And also attacking into the block as well. You see, they went to health to convert it, but again, it didn't convert because... Off the cap. Oh, I didn't even see where unblockable there. Yeah, I've always got to like test the block, man.
Oh, no. I was trying to tap in medium after that, then special three. Didn't quite work out. It was all right for the first try. Again, I think about four or five revives. If we can play well, is going to be the um, uh, the goal to go for here. Because, again, Unstoppable just slows down this fight massively. How long do we have left on the booster as well? Okay, we got one more try on the booster, and then we need to uh, reload on that. So, uh, yeah, let's... Um, a couple of these for good luck, and let's jump in. Unstoppable Colossus. He's just a pain, man. It's the Unstoppable, the Colossus. We just don't love to see it. Oh, I should have just been more aggressive with the combo there. Right, I'm getting murked. It's all part of the plan, man. Go below 50%, get more damage, more, more gains. I do see a, a super chat at the corner of my eye. I'll get around to it in just a, a second after we finish this attempt. Might be able to, might be able to have a quick look during the special three. Yo, what is up, Ed? Dude, thank you very much for the HK uh, $100 super chat. Massive, massive love, bro. I need to sort out the conversion uh, for that, but then I think that... He's going to make your blob race well of the day, but again, I, I'm terrible with the um, uh, conversion rate. But dude, thank you so much for the support, mate. I really, really do appreciate it. Smash him for a combo here. A few cheeky hits into the block. Get him to special two. Bait this one out. Got to wait out on stop ball as well. Again, this fight just doesn't have great pacing. It's just a bit weighed about. And then I think we'll go for a special two here. Go for a three combo, straight into special two. Good, I'm glad I didn't go for a five combo, man. Would have been a bit too much power. We've got to wait this out. So first enrage has just kicked in. Oh gosh, we really don't have many hit points left. <laughs> just the fact we get a, we got a bit walloped at the beginning. So yeah, we want to try and uh, get a few more combos in where we can. I think I'm just going to leave it here, man. This is like a good time to um, get my final fury and then just dip out. And then we've got Saber 2 fully ramped. And yeah, that's perfect. Cool, cool. So yeah, we should have the full uh, 30 furies now. And then we can go for a level 2 revive. Chuck some potions in. But anyway, I think we have a new uh, blobbery spell of the day. HK to USD. So that is uh, equivalent to, I believe, a $13 super chat there. So, Ed, thank you so much, man. Absolute massive love there. Uh, so, yeah, thank you for the support. And, yeah, cheers for everybody knocking about in chat today, man. Hopefully, you're all doing well. I appreciate you being here throughout this uh, this long and perilous journey that we're embarking on today. Uh, one thing I do need to do, actually, no, we'll heal, we'll heal up and then we'll uh, friggin', uh, what was it, boost up after? What's that? <laughs> oh yeah, I saw those new uh, One Division characters in Future Fight, man. Again, we got Scarlet Witch on the roster, but I'm not too sure how she's going to be available. Would have been nice if she was like the Karina Challenge Trophy Reward, man. That would have been cool. Um, 
but yeah, hopefully there's going to be, I don't know, some sort of crystal or event or like really cool thing to get her. I don't know if it's going to be tied to, um, uh, what is it, Act 7.2? We got that coming out this month. Hopefully it's not Legends, man. I, I am not a, uh, a Legends runner. Okay, right. We needed to uh, stall out that stun a bit more. And if we're lucky, this is, uh... One more revive. Just gotta play well. Here, I'm aiming to get him down to 20%. Those, those repowerings are getting better. I feel like this challenge is really gonna help me just like uh, have my skills sharp ready for the Grandmaster's Gauntlet. So yeah, my reparries, they've been getting a little bit better recently, man, because uh, <laughs> a couple of months ago, I like couldn't reparry. So the fact that I can sometimes now, is that's a, that's a decent improvement. Really close to our 20% target here, man. I think regardless, I'll quit out about 15% because I do need to like leave enough health just to make sure I can uh, build up special 3 if I do go in again. Getting a few, uh, few free hits though. But yeah, I actually think this is like this is the time to dip on this fight. So I'm just gonna get wrecked because again, I need to make sure I can special three every single fight. And if I get him around 10%, if I get super lucky with the crits, there's a chance that um, uh, yeah, just might <laughs> might not have the chance to build up to that. So I think we'll just we'll play it safe here, man. Just make sure we got plenty of time to uh, ramp this man up. Let's go for a few of these as well, and I think we are good to go. Jump in, man. Oh, yes, dude. I'm so sorry. I forgot to update the name there. That's massive, massive error on my part. Sorry, Lance. I was a little bit, little bit distracted there. Um. Oh, yeah, I did update it, didn't I? My thing is uh, updated. Let me have a quick look. There we go. Oh, you're saying change it to HK. I don't want to change it to HK just because, um, uh, what is it? Uh, again, the majority of reference for people is, uh, is USD, dude. So that, that's the conversion uh, to USD. So yeah, we always have it regardless of the currency donated in, uh, US dollars. Sorry, I forgot. I thought I forgot to change the name. Lucky, uh, lucky, luckily, <laughs> I'm not that off point today. <laughs> so yeah, that's good to know.
Oh, right, nice. We got that out of him. And then we'll just go for, uh, I think, special three now, actually. Cool, cool. Right. Sorry, lads. We just need to ban somebody in chat. Right, there we go, mate. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was just, like, getting all these messages, dude. Uh, from this kid that's been, like, mad Larry. Just tagging everybody. I think they were all hidden for you guys. And I'm so glad. Uh... So yeah, I was like, I'll just, I'll just put this man in the bin quick. Right, that should be it. Nice. Okay, yeah, so that was uh, nowhere near as painful as some of my first experiences on Unstoppable Colossus. And now we got to make sure we go for the big boy Colossus here. So we got to go left. And then we hit the fork. And we go right. And then Colossus. Dude, Colossus is just going to be a bit of a grind fest here. Oh, gosh. I'm not thrilled about this fight but it's a it's a hurdle that we have to overcome today oh thank you very much sledge i appreciate that man really wish i could use dexterity as well as i do oh thank you very much just takes uh just takes a little bit of practice mate everything is just like practice and timing in this game dude and the more you uh, play, you get the more you get used to uh, those mechanics in every match. We're actually already taking down two percent. Okay, this might not be as painful as I thought it initially would be. <laughs> so we're literally going to be here for like an hour. I think was it was there like BG's Gwenpool run? <laughs> he was just here for was it Gwenpool run? I think through the labyrinth. He's just here for like ages, dude. I remember. Those crit, dude, seeing 10k crits on Colossus is giving me life right now. So, yeah, I certainly appreciate those. Yeah, please don't spam emojis in the chat, dude. This is your yeah, first and final warning. If you do that, I'm just gonna have to ban you, mate. I don't wanna be giving out permanent bans on the channel. But. If I gotta do it, I gotta do it, mate. Making me think I'm probably going to use Star Lord with Suicide Masteries as well, man. Imagine, like, if, if Sabertooth's working really well with Suicides, again, I don't see any reason why we shouldn't use Star Lord um, with Suicides as well. Or uh, Suicide's, like, not that big for Star Lord because he gets so much additional damage ramp up. I don't know. What do you guys think? When we go for the Star Lord runs, Suicide Masteries, or no Suicide Masteries, what, what should we go for? And yeah, dude, I see a couple of Super Chats popping up. Cheers, lads. I'll check them out in a second, man. We just need to get uh, Colossus to uh, enrage. See if we can get 80% is the goal here, man. If we can get this man, like, just below 80%, that'd be perfect. And get on track for... Um, A four revive takedown. That'd be great. Oh, 
like, yes. <laughs> Dude, the unblockable synergy was mad clutch there. Let's go. Fantastic. Let's go! <laughs> uh, that wasn't bad, dude. That certainly was not bad at all. Yo, okay, we got three super chats, bro. First off, mad love to my boy, Liam John. Dude, thank you so much for the £10 super chat. Maybe consider a YouTube member-only chat. Uh, weed out the sweaty kids who want to argue and tell you how to play the game. I, st I still like keeping my... um. Uh, what is it? My, my chat public. Just It's nice to include everybody. Uh, but yeah, I do need to look at doing something uh, for the members as well, man, and kind of growing that a little bit more. But yeah, thank you very much for the support, man. Uh, really do appreciate it. And also, mad love to Nathy as well. Uh, pulled my first five-star Aegon from hand-to-hand -hand combat crystal after watching your video. Worth to rank four? Dude, Aegon is worth to rank five, man. You should definitely max that man out. Again, he just slaps for... Um... Uh, so much important progression stuff in the game. So yeah, I'd really suggest it. And also, mad love to Patra as well. Donating a $20 super chat. Patra, absolute massive, massive love there. So Patra is our officially our new blubbery swell of the day with that $20 super chat. So yeah, mental love, mate. And thank you very much, sir. Right. <sighs> Let's stay hydrated and crack on. I'm going to need to fill my water up in a little bit. We've been going for uh, an hour and ten minutes now. <laughs> it's going quite decently so far. I don't think anything's been like overly painful. So yeah, it's been it's been nice that we haven't cried on camera yet. Um, yeah, let's go for a couple of these just to make sure, and then let's jump in. Yeah, if we can if we can go for just below uh, sixty percent here, that's kind of the goal on this run. <laughs> that Guardian synergy with the extended stun duration is mad clutch, man. So good. And the 100% uh, perfect block as well. That's why the uh, the stuns are uh, so much longer on the uh, the first uh, few parries. Then I think we're pretty safe to five combo straight into a special three here. Then we get our persistent charge, so we've got this try locked in the bag as long as we get that special three off every fight man again we ain't we ain't sweating too much here but i feel like it's going to be a fight like um maestro or magic where i might not be able to get off the special three again there's so much rng in the magic matchup sometimes it can be uh Really, really tricky. Oh, I should have actually gone for more special twos in this fight. Okay, right. I think we'll just go for another special three here. And then we'll uh, dump that and then special two spam. But again, the target for this one is uh, just below 60%. 55 would be good. 55 is dream target, man. Oh no! <laughs> no! <laughs> what a dick! He just evaded me straight into special two. Oh, that is a womp 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 right there, man. Oh god, that is that is gosh, that really is the uh freaking Labyrinth of Legends for you right there, man. My good lord. 
Not happy about that one, boys. I'm not over the moon, I must admit. Um, at least that didn't happen before we throw the through the first special three. <laughs> oh, mate. God. Reminded why uh, we had a bit of a painful time at some points in the labyrinth. <laughs> I did get ruined there, man. Oh, we got finessed. Yeah, I'm looking forward to uh, doing the low-key cheese one, man. I saw I saw actually quite a lot of people have done that one already. I think pretty much every challenge has been done now by somebody, at least to the best of my knowledge. So yeah, Sweeter rinsed the Kamala challenge. Does anybody know, have people like uploaded videos of the Inhumans and Star-Lord challenge? I think like all of that stuff, you know, it has been done in the past. So I don't see a reason why it would not be um, done <laughs> literally in the first few hours. So yeah, we're going to have like, I, I assume like a fair few people by the end of uh, today that have done like all nine challenges already. Right, so what's the target here? Um, if we could, if we could play catch up and get him to forty percent, man, that'd be good. I mean, it's so ambitious, but maybe it can happen. I literally get another hundred hits though. Let's go, saber tooth, big crits. Oh damn, we need that like final. <laughs> <laughs> Final hit to crit. That's like a solid 1% off Colossus. Big crit. Nice, dude. Nice. That's 38k there. That was magical. Please take that. Come on, 40%. Oh, nice, dude. Nice. That's so good. These are the kind of crits we need. Oh, mate, I'm toasted here. Oh, 42%, not bad, dude. We got 23% off there. If then I can get him to um, Assassin's range on this next run, then yes, it's going to be looking real good, man. So, yeah, we'll take that, mate. We'll take that. And, uh, yeah, what is up, dude? Massive love to uh, Gan. Thank you very much for the uh, 100 rupee super chat there. Uh, watch and see and do my school assignments. Having a great time. Thank you for the content and entertainment. Dude, it's all good, man. Best of luck with your assignments. And uh, thank you very much for the super chat as well. And also, mad love to uh, Nathy. Dude, thank you so much for the additional five British pound super chat there. Will Kabam ever see sense and cash in on adding Worthy Cap, Stormbreaker, Thor, or Glaive Thanos? Bro, 100%, man. I want all three of those. I wail so hard if all three of those champions... um. Uh, came in like it just it never made sense to me why they didn't add them in because Kabam love money and that is just like a massive massive pile there but oh my god dude Chris dropping down coming straight in today $50 super chat Chris thank you so much bro 
Good luck, mate. Six out of nine complete on your end. Dude, you are smashing it, mate. You are absolutely smashing it. But you've definitely got it rolling with Mikey's Cyclops Challenge. Uh, which ones have you done so far? And like, what has been like the most difficult for you, in, at least in your opinion? Because, yeah, the Cyclops one, uh, Cyclops one was like a, a big challenge, like getting to uh, the Collector. But the Collector was just, just like spend, <laughs> spend your revives, man. So yeah, I, I I've like I've enjoyed all the challenges so far, but I also like doing the live streams as well, man. But yeah, it sounds like you're you're trailblazing, mate. So great work, um, and yeah, hopefully it sounds like you're probably going to be done uh, in the next couple of days, I would assume. Uh, right, let's go for a uh, a level five health potion there. Okay, we got to try and get him to twenty percent here. Uh, we can do it if we're aggressive enough, man. Let's go for three of these, get him pretty much fully topped up. And let's jump in. But yeah, guys, thank you all so much for the Super Chats, man. It's been going... Dude, the last, like, month has been crazy for Super Chats. It's just been beyond ridiculous, man. So yeah, thank you uh, all so much for the support. It's been wild. Just need some really good crits here. Let's bundle in with this. But yeah, I'm going to try and get... My personal goal is to try and get the challenges done before the release of um, 7.2, if I can. I think I'm a bit worried about the Kamala one, and uh, I'm a little bit worried about... Labyrinth for Star... Lab I think Labyrinth for Star Lord and Medusa are going to be fine. They're just going to be a bit long. It's my... Um... <laughs> My thoughts. Oh, yeah, dude. Colossus is going to be so long with Medusa, man. It's going to take days. I'm thinking of just keeping on Suicide Masteries. Maybe for both runs. But, um... Yeah, we'll see what happens moving forward. Oh, actually, I should have just gone for it. I should have tested the block a bit more. Right, let's smash in. Hopefully, we can get a special two final hit crit. I think I think we're on good pace for twenty percent here, and then if we can get twenty percent here, hopefully, we can have one final try in assassin's range. Just smoke this man, and then we're in a really good spot. Right, come on, fella. I feel like the crits have been fantastic this run so far. Next up, we got Falcon, dude. Dude, Falcon should be a fantastic fight. I'm very excited for Falcon. But I, do, I do need to refill my water <laughs> after the... <laughs> my water. <laughs> uh, after we uh, get this Colossus down. But yeah, we're well on track for that 20% target there. Get this man, like... You can even get him a little bit lower. Anything... Uh, Close to 15% would be good. That rage timer. Oh gosh. Yeah, that rage timer moves so quick when it goes on to the second cycle. So yeah, let's just try and meet that 20% target first. Come on, big crit here. Nice, 40k, let's go, Sabretooth. This man is going off. He's an absolute monster. We'd love to see it, lads. We'd love to see it. Let's push him into uh, Assassin's range as well. So the uh, the big boy numbers can kick in. To be fair, we got so little left on the enraged that I was like, yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to send that a special two, man. Maybe dunk her <laughs> one or two times. But yeah, we're fine there. 16%. That was really, really good. Right. Let's um go for... I, you know, 
I think in all honesty, lads, we might as well just buy a 10 stacker of revives. <laughs> I mean, it's not like we are not going to need revives uh, all over the place. So yeah, let's go for one of these, man. We're going to need to buy some health potions as well soon. We've been uh, melting the stash so far today. It's, uh, it's all going to a good cause. Hopefully this this is... I'm telling myself, dude, the six star Nexus, like, we're going to get a do more torch out of it. 100% confirmed. Indeed, the opening, uh, I think... I'm going to, like, save up all of the Karina Challenge stuff and do, like, a, um, a massive opening to celebrate once I uh, complete everything. Because then, yeah, we should have uh, six stars for days. Oh, my God, that was not a great start. Yeah, that evade uh, definitely screwed me a little bit there. But one thing I love about Saber Tooth is just that regeneration to uh, help him bounce back. A bit scared to leave myself open now. Come on, fella. Okay, nice. So we got the persistent charge. We don't need to worry about <laughs> losing it, which is good. We're still a uh, still a seven man. That's great. I'm preparing to like lose um lose a few whole magic and <laughs> all of them on Maestro. Uh, I think that's what I'm mentally preparing for. Maybe one or two on War Machine if we had, if we have some bad luck. War Machine's a bit of a pain. Ant Man's annoying, dude. Ant Man's mad annoying. Right, we love an aggressive Colossus. Evaded there. Okay, we got it back on track. That's a fantastic crit. That is exactly what we needed there. Come on, final crit. Damn it, so close. So close. Okay, nice man, nice. That was still a good run. I think that was four revives on Colossus for a four star. That's not bad, dude. Like Colossus is a pain. Um, so yeah, that was brilliant. Okay, I think we reach a uh, junction here. I want to make sure we go straight on. Don't want to go left. I think the left goes to Magneto or something like that. Okay, nice. We got Falcon right, lads. I'm going to be right back uh, just for a couple of minutes. Um, and then, yeah. Yo, what is up, my boy Ben? Sorry, I was a little bit uh, slow replying to the super chat, mate. In a dilemma again, 20% T5 select uh, Mutant or Cosmic. Apocalypse or Cosmic Ghost Rider to rank 3. Have them both 5 star rank 5. Hmm. I think it's tough to say at the moment. Uh, just because, like... You know, we got 7.2 and also uh, Grandmaster's Gauntlet about to come out. So yeah, if you're not like in a massive rush, maybe like hold off on the challenge for a little bit. Um, or just go with the one that you enjoy the most. Because Cosmic Ghost Rider, again, he can fit into any team. Apocalypse kind of needs, you know, ideally the synergy characters built around him to make him just a bit easier to ramp up and also get a bit more damage. So yeah, maybe Cosmic Ghost Rider, but also Apocalypse definitely has his uses in 7.2 as well. But yeah, we don't know about the Grand Master's Gordler or the Summer of Pain. But I think either one, dude, I don't think you want to regret the decision there. So yeah, go for go with your gut. Go with whoever you fancy there, mate. Uh, but anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let me be right back. I need to fill up my water. Sorry, I cut off my mug a bit too early then. Be right back.
Alright, ladies and gentlemen, now we're back, so uh, if you are just tuning in, um, we are at Falcon currently, so we got Falcon, maybe not too bad, Gamora, gonna suck a little bit, actually no, Gamora's fine, <laughs> it's magic that's gonna suck a little bit, actually magic's probably gonna suck a lot, uh, so yeah, I am, uh, I'm looking forward to it, I guess, I'm looking forward to it being done, uh, but yeah, we're not too far off now. Let's go for a couple of potions here, and uh, one thing actually, I need to uh, go back and just uh, smash the claim, because yeah, I got so many like level two um, freaking potions, dude. Like looking at this as well, man. I got, <laughs> I got. I wish I could merge these small energy refills. We have like three hundred crystals yesterday, dude. Uh, so yeah, I, I I need to find a place to use those, dude. Gonna be uh, smashing out Cavalier 100% using uh, five energy boosters. I wish you could, um, is, is there a way to mass use them? I think there might be, if you like load them up via the top or something. Um, I can't quite remember, it's been a while. Just usually on my well account, I'm so lazy, man. I'm like, ah oh, yeah, four energy refill, you know, 30 units, we'll take it, mate, we'll take it. Go on then, don't have to, don't have to haggle me down too much. Yo, what's up, Sketchy? Massive love to Yad as well. Thank you for tuning into uh, today's live stream. Don't know why, dude. After watching Falcon and Winter Soldier, I'm a bit, bit more scared of, bit more scared of Falcon. <laughs> it's too much of a beast, this man. Dude, Falcon and Winter Soldier was great. Both Falcon and Winter Soldier and One Division, I would say, like decently surpassed my expectations. I don't know um, how you guys found those programs, but let me know in chat. Falcon and Winter Soldier and One Division, did they meet or surpass your expectations, or did you feel a little bit disappointed? And if you did, then why? But try not to give any spoilers. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if you haven't watched Falcon and Winter Falcon and Winter Soldier and One Division, uh, definitely put them on your list, man. They're great to watch. But also, if you haven't watched them already, fake fan, <laughs> fake Marvel fan. I'm kidding, man. I'm kidding. We all got busy lives, man. one shot here be great i don't think we have the damage range to one shot so yeah we're aiming like 50 percent and below we get this man to a comfy 40 percent we are big chilling on the next one dude that was a mega special two there wow Oh, yes, let's go. <laughs> oh, did you guys see that special too? Saber Tooth is popping off, mate. He's going crazy. Oh, damn, bro. I wish I had me a four star Saber Tooth back in the day. <laughs> uh, all the in-game veterans doing these challenges are like, dudes, this is meant to be a challenge, bro? This is easier than my first run back in the day. I think I'm just going to throw a special one here just so I can get this man to a special two. At the same time, I just don't have many, many hit points left. I actually do need to like leave a little bit of health anyway, so I think we'll, because uh, I need to get a special three to ramp up assistant. Let's see if we get a big crit. We're going to die from recall anyway. It's a good send though, dude. Yeah, very happy with that one. Nice. I'm glad uh, I'm glad more people uh, enjoyed those series. I'm really looking forward to that. I've got high expectations for Loki though. I had kind of like mid expectations for both WandaVision and... Um, uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier, but Loki. Maybe, maybe, maybe I should. Because if you have low expectations, man, I feel like it's easier to uh, be be pleased with stuff. 
Aim low to avoid disappointment. That age-old saying is uh, unfortunately quite true in the majority of scenarios. Sabretooth, so I think Sabretooth is still in my solid god tier category. People have been trying to get uh, me to move him down, but I still think like with the, uh, the Sasquatch and Killmonger synergies, again, there's a lot of cool stuff he can do. And he does hit like a truck. I mean, this is a four star, dude. <laughs> You get like a six star rank too. It does, doesn't even need to be awakened as well. You can you can like just easily walk this content, man. And plus for like six star as well, you don't need to worry about the super short enrage timer that you do with uh, using a four star champion. So yeah, I think you can actually one shot um, the majority of bosses with a proper saber tooth team. If you're just looking for uh, easy completion. But yeah, Sabretooth is literally like the carrying champion of the Canada Challenge. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh. That's great, man. Okay, let's go for a special two. It just feels good seeing like 10k mediums out of a four star champion, man. Like the fact that, you know, once you ramp him up and get going, as long as you can throw one special three every fight, it's just super easy to maintain the damage. This guy, depending on the, what the conditions are for the Grandmaster's uh, Gauntlet, could, could be a bit of an MVP. Depends on what the bosses are, what the conditions are. And like how easily you're going to get wrecked every single fight. I think actually, if there's a lot of challenge, maybe not so much. Because <laughs> yeah, you still need to get to a special three every fight. So it depends how uh, accepting that is and what the health pools are. So yeah, it's kind of impossible to tell at the moment. But I don't know, might, might be one to keep in mind. It's quite good. Uh, was it Brian or somebody else that did like an abyss run for a bit of fun with Sabretooth? I think it was Brian. Um, but yeah, he, he can definitely like bring the source in the right scenario. Okay, we got 20 minutes left on the, uh, the booster here. The old days when Sven was allowed on this channel. Sven's still allowed on this channel, dude. I feel like just as I've... Um, grown up i just feel the like i like to save the words for the right occasion because if i'm swearing all the time and it's like if you swear all the time it kind of takes the meaning out of the swear words <laughs> Where, whereas if you like swear at the you know like when you really need them i know it like, sounds like a little bit corny but you know if, if you know you know but like if you're like f this f that it just kind of like takes takes away the impact so I like to use an appropriately timed fuck now and again. Just when <laughs> we really are being screwed over. So yeah, you, you got to save it for the right occasion. You know, it's, it's all about finessing those, uh, those cast words. But yeah, like early 20s, see a man, F this, F that. <laughs> uh, definitely, uh, definitely dropping bombs all over the place, mate. Also, when I've been, um, <laughs> when I've been stuff like New York Comic Con and like, uh, you know, like families of people come up to me with their kids and they're like, oh, my, uh, <laughs> my, uh, my kids love all your videos. And I'm like, dude, you know, this is back in the day where I'm doing like all the CEO videos. I'm like, F this, F that. I'm like, oh gosh, I am a terrible role model. Uh. But yeah, I, you know, I don't... Certainly not like renounce swearing or anything. I just like to use it a bit, bit more conservatively for the right occasion. Oh, 
right. Come on, man. We're aiming for below 50% here. It's going well. I kind of went on autopilot for this fight, man. You know, <laughs> I don't even know where that first like 30% went. Right, come on, big crit. Oh, let's dunk it, mate. Perfect. 43%. Very, very happily take that. Cena hasn't sworn in a year now, at least. <laughs> you haven't been watching the 7th Any Sins channel, mate. Oh, my God. Sometimes I get so frustrated. Uh, yeah, I just, I just, I go off, bro. I go off. But, yeah. Um, I just, I like to, they're, they're a good outlet to express frustration, man. So, yeah, it's, it's a good time. Anybody else having a rank for Gwenpool at 5k PI? Is that for, like, 4-star, I assume? Right, let's jump back in. Come on, one more run at this Gamora. We can get her down without using another revive if we're a little bit lucky here. Um, and don't get murdered by a Clown Fiesta... Evasion. Okay, right. I'm, I'm glad she didn't immediately evade and then counter with special one. She could have done that. Because that would have, uh, yeah, just one shot me, I think. <laughs> so, yeah, Gamor Gamora's a little bit scary, dude. I remember a few times in the past where she just, like, evades straight into special attack. Like, we hampered Colossus a bit earlier. You can't just get murdered on this fight. What are we getting the mates here for champions? Soon, man. It's going to be at some point uh, this weekend or in the next few days. So, yeah, we always wait for the new champions to get buffed. But this week's been so busy with content, dude. There's so much coming out. I was a bit... Dude, one of my least viewed videos yesterday was the friggin' roadmap video. I was like, what? What? <laughs> All the roadmap videos were doing terrible. I was like, dude, I thought these videos would be blown up. I thought people would be gassed. The Creators Challenge video, just talking about the objectives. Um, that one's got like double the views, I think, of the roadmap video last time I checked. I was like, this makes no sense, man. Maybe I needed like a better thumbnail or something. The roadmap video is hype, in my opinion, dude. I was, I was gassed on that. I'm incredibly excited for the uh, the next, uh, what was it, 6 to 12 months? We got a truckload of stuff coming. But solo, com solo competitive is going to be fun, dude. I am, I'm very interested to see, like, how it ends up working and who actually becomes, like, the top players in solo competitive and, like, whether or not it's more money or more skill. Because, um, again, you can, like, have all the friggin', um, you can, like, buy everything, dude. But if you still, like, don't know the right matches and right counters, then you're going to get clapped. And if you can't, like, play those really difficult matches, like in the Summoner Showdown, you're also going to get clapped. So, yeah. I don't know. It just seems like it's going to be a, a bit of a crazy time. Um, but anyway, we got Magic up next here. All oh, right, man. This is uh, it's going to be a bit scary. I think we go in with Saber 2 Fear. We need to make sure we're fully topped up. Um... Find the potions, one of these bad boys, and then we'll go for um, three of these as well. And then let's see what we can do. I, my goal is to do this one in like an Odin's man, and Odin's would be good. Um, yes, yeah, it's, it's time for magic. Bit nervous, bit nervous. Hopefully, we don't get shafted by the limbo RNG. I actually don't have Pacify uh, in my Suicide Mastery setup, so yeah, we don't even need to uh, worry about that. Dude, 
you. She's propped every single limbo so far. Dude, she's popped four limbos in a row. Go away, magic. Nobody likes you. Ooh. Is this really how it's going to be like, man? Limbo after limbo after limbo. Oh, it's five limbos in a row. Yeah, why not? Fun. See what happens. But let's let's see what the boy Warby can do here, man. Okay, and we're getting no crits. Wolverine has completely forgotten how to find his critical strikes here. So yeah, that's uh, annoying. Right, well, back to back to Saber Two Fitters here. Um, <laughs> yeah, well, that sucked, dude. That sucked. Again, if we get a little bit lucky, I think we can get uh, maybe like twenty percent off, dude. But ugh, this is not going to be a fun time, is it? One of these, and then let's go for uh, three of these, and then actually maybe I'll put a health booster on as well. If there was a time for. What, how am I doing on health boosters, dude? I'm really, really low on attack boosters. So, yeah, I think I saved the attack boosters for, like, another run. But health boosters. Um, yeah, I got a few of these, mate. Let's go for Let's go for one of these bad boys. Yo, Chris, thank you very much, man. Should we a pain with Star-Lord 2? At least in humans, you do have Quake. That is true, man. That is true. Quake's just... Quake's going to be so good, but she's going to be uh, <laughs> quite long for the fight, I would assume. But yeah, dude, thank you very much for all the super chats and support today, man. At least we know, even if we get, like, the worst RNG possible on this magic, um, we can still get special three and get the persistent charge to maintain. So that's fantastic to know. Okay, this run, we've got, like, opposite end of the spectrum where we're getting super lucky. So, yeah, this this is what we like to see, man. This is definitely putting me in a much better mood here. Again, if we get a good run, it's, like, 20%, dude. I think maybe a bit maybe a bit more if it's a really, really good run. We need this uh, crazy luck to continue. Fantastic. Okay, that was my bad there. Okay, we are well overdue a limbo. Oh, nice. Didn't get the massive crit there, but still pretty damn good. Nice no limbo there. I'm probably about to die. Yeah, we might as well send it. Uh, yeah, that, that was a great try, dude. That was 28% there. So much better in comparison to the first one. We got so stupidly lucky there, though. Um, so, yeah, I'm incredibly pleased with the results of that. Uh, but, yeah, Chris, dude, thank you very much. Another $10 super chat, man. Right, let's go for um, another revive. I'm feeling lots better Lots better. A lot better. <laughs> After that try. Definitely much better spirits now. I think the uh, the health booster like helps as well. Just keep keep Saber Tooth alive a little bit longer. Alright, magic's decided she's Spider-Man here. Hopefully she doesn't heal that back up. Nice. Okay, that is amazing. That was a really good chunk. Already got 10% here. Let's go. Let's go for another 20% try, man. 
Have twenty percent try would be amazing. Oh no, dude. Oh mate. That was just unlucky. She just like evaded us in the corner, straight in, stunned, binned. Big rip there, boys. Spam Guardian. Yeah, I, I know Guardian can work for this fight, lads, but the thing is, I don't have Guardian ranked up. <laughs> so, yeah, he's only ranked one, and I don't want to use the resources. But thank you for spamming chat, man. I appreciate it, lads. Well, let's, go for, let's go for this. Again, I think Sabertooth's fine for this one. But it's a lot of resources to rank Guardian up uh, just for this one <laughs> one fight. So yeah, I'm, I'm just I'm just not that fussed about it, dude. Well, it'll be the second half of this one fight as well. That wasn't a bad run, dude. That was alright there. 34%. If we're super lucky, it's only going to take uh, two more revives here. So, yeah, we'll see what we can do here, man. Yeah, we're, we're, getting, we're getting this down quick, man. It's going really, really well. Uh, oh, dude, I forgot special three there. Damn. Yeah, sorry, I was too busy thinking about um, trap spam and guardian, dude. Oh, yeah, I forgot special three a couple of times, actually. Damn, dude. Okay, yeah, I got got a bit too distracted. That's bad. Okay, I got a special three, man. Oh my goodness. Yeah, sorry, I've been bleeding charges here. Okay, big mistakes, big mistakes. Oh, dude. Not too happy about that. It's all right. We've we lost a couple. I was expecting that we'd like lose a couple anyway on this uh, some magic. So that kind of like factors into uh, calculations. But yeah, just for safety, I wish I had uh, paid a bit more attention there. Damn it, bro! Right, I'm just going to quit out before the uh, the last limbo tick there. And we should be good now to special three, get the final charge, and then uh, finesse back in. But yeah, I'm still feeling like a bit of a mug, not, forget, not going for those special threes. Alright, let's go for it. She's almost down, and then we're through magic. Then we got War Machine and Ant Man. Oh god, it's such a savage trio of characters back to back. Okay, so we've got the first limbo proc. Again, I need limbo to uh not proc here. Okay, that's really good to get the limbo proc that time. Fantastic. One has to try and bait on that SP1. Okay, nice, we didn't get the limbo proc. It's good, it's 
Let's go for this. Nice, no limbo there. Okay, right, we only lost two charges on that fight overall, and both of those were to me being distracted by chat, so. <laughs> Not bad, lads. We still got five left, uh, potentially. That's a lot of screw-ups for um, uh, the rest of the run and uh, Maestro, but yeah, I've, ideally, if we could avoid that, that would be uh, brilliant. Hmm. Okay, War Machine. We are going to need to uh, get topped up. I'm going to go back, claim... Uh, are we on for boosters here? Okay, 47 seconds. Actually, I'm going to heal up quick, jump into this, and then we'll go um, uh, claim stuff and then jump back in. So, yeah, let's go for one of these. Um, one of these. And then we're good to go. And the good thing is we still got the health booster active for um, this fight as well, which is fantastic because the block damage... He's probably not going to be too kind on the uh, the class relationship here. Right, cool. Um, so I think War Machine again, because of uh, this fight being a massive pain, uh, we'll go for like 25% goal every single run. I think is the way to go. Hopefully 33%, man. That'd be the dream. Let's try and shoot 25% of his uh, health pull off every single time. Yeah, we got murked by that. My evasion was uh, not on point. Might be able to come back a little bit here. Got the regeneration from the awakened ability. Okay, let's go. 25%, mate. 25%. For the <laughs> for the size of the screw up, we've actually made a pretty good comeback here. And I'm about to die. Yeah. Okay. Not bad. We got up to 69%. A cheeky one for the lads there, boys. See, so yeah, I happily take that. Yo, what is up, James Hall? Well ahead of me as always. So far, only done Mystic Dispersed, Astral Anger. And the uh, 1992, the lot one somewhat scare me. But yeah, the Saber 2 Fond, dude, it's going really nice so far, I must admit. Um, so yeah, you just got to remember to start with a special three every single fight. Bring in Sasquatch as well. A bit of Guardian for safety. Um, 
and yeah, you're having a great time. But here, we want to go back, uh, claim some level 2 potions here. And then we want to get Sabertooth topped up, and then we want to boost. So yeah, let's go for it in that order. <laughs> Just making sure I don't leave Labyrinth as well, dude. That's the most savage thing. I know people that have just, like, accidentally uh, quit out or... Yeah, been messing about uh, halfway through and just find themselves a bit screwed over. Okay, so let's get that. Chuck on the 30% um, booster. Praise to all of the early access bundles for these boosters, man. They're a good time. Again, back in my day, mate. Back in my day, we didn't have these 30% uh, boosters. Only had 20%, mate. You got your 20% and that, that was enough. You may do. But nowadays, even more power knocking about. I didn't want to go for anything too risky until I've got the uh, special three. And then ideally, you want to evade like right at the right time on War Machine Special 1, and then you can, um... Punish. Okay, perfect. So we're aiming to get this man to, um... I think below 40% would be ideal if we can. Let's try. He needs to play aggressively, though. Oh, no. <laughs> Look, I'm not looking for knee to the face aggressive, though, mate, so this man can chew on that one. No, <laughs> yeah, he got the evasion there. Just threw me off a, a little bit off base. Uh, we're still kind of meeting that twenty-five percent goal though. So yeah, let's go for another one of these. Uh, chugging a ten k potion, um, and then a few of these, and then we're good to go. Oh, but then we got Ant Man off this dude. Oh, I hate Ant Man. Ant Man's a pain. Not as like scary as War Machine. War Machine's like. It's a bit scary to deal with. Right, perfect. Yo, what is up? Good morning to uh, Jonathan and Paul. Yeah, dude, we're going in for it, man. We are. We're a good way around uh, so far. We did all right this morning. Had some good fights, some bad fights. But yeah, I don't think anything's been that bad. In all fairness, man. Oh, no, he got the evasion. Right, nice. <laughs> that unblockable straight into the uh, the block with the old man Logan Synergy's mad clutch there. I think we'll go for this just to push him to special two. Looking for 25% here, ideally, if we can. Amazing.
Right, perfect. Yeah, that lines it up magically. Next try for Assassin's Range there. So yeah, that was really, really good. Yo, good morning, Michael Gray. Thank you very much for the five British pound super chat there. Hey, see and love the channel. What upcoming Marvel movie am I most looking forward to? Oh, damn. I think I'd be lying if I said it wasn't Spider-Man. I'm really looking forward to Doctor Strange, though. Doctor Strange should be great. Uh, Thor as well. Thor, like, Strange and uh, Spider-Man, I think are the big three for me, man. Again, I just, I love uh, all the previous movies. Well, Thor 2 is a bit dodgy, but, like, first Doctor Strange was incredible. Um, Spider-Man, I'm just, like, a big Spider-Man fanboy, like, generally speaking. But Thor, Thor, I'm interested to see, like, what they do and where they go with Thor now as a character. So, yeah, I'm a bit, a bit curious about um, how that's going to turn out. But, yeah, dude, thank you very much for the support and super chat, man. I certainly do appreciate it. <laughs> Apparently, I left myself wide open there. <laughs> oh, what a mug. Okay, right. I need to get the special three off of this fight before I uh, mess up. We can still get the, the closing deal here, man. Okay, that's nice. I think I got the timing of dashing out of that toward the end now. If you get the timing of dashing out the end, then yeah, you can just punish. This takes a little, a little while to get into. Come on, big crit, big crit hit. Damn. Okay, still enough, man. Still enough. Okay, right. Need to focus here. I need to make sure I don't go for Spider-Man. Avoid Spider-Man. Spider-Man would be hell, dude. Okay, nice. <laughs> We're past Spider-Man. That's good. That's really, really good. To make sure I still avoid the X-23 in the corner. Hmm. Alright, let's go for another one of these. And then a stack of these couple of these as well. Actually, I think we probably only needed one there. But yeah, let's jump into the uh, the Ant-Man fight now. I think we've got everything ready. Need to remember special three first, and then um, get spam special twos. He's not really, like, glancing much here, because <laughs> the base damage is so high. Okay, Ant-Man doesn't look like he's going to be that bad. Because, dude, Star-Lord on this fight. Getting four-star Star-Lord ramped up on this fight, like, sucks a fat one, man. Even getting five-star rank four Star-Lord against that man. I remember was sucking a fat one. But, yeah, Sabertooth, because there's so much base attack, he's not really, like, mitigating it too much through his glancing, which is amazing. So, yeah, Ant-Man is uh, not going to be as much of a problem. Again, he's still got damage mitigation. So, he's still going to take a bit longer than the average uh, fight. But, yeah, uh, we should be pretty good here. <clears throat> I think we'll aim for about 25% every single run. And that will be uh, three revives. So, yeah, that'll be good. Go 33, that'd be amazing. I think we actually might be able to get 33 here. Got to set you, try and set yourself achievable goals for, like, each of these fights in terms of, like, how much you can get off before the Enrage just comes and smacks you in the face. I, yeah, I think we can go 33%, so you want to get him to 66% uh, here. Let's get a little bit more ambitious, man. 20, uh... Or oh, 67%, sorry. 66% <laughs> is 34% of his health. I 
don't know, dude. Maybe we can actually push this man to 50%. I don't know. Actually, one thing uh, one thing I just remembered is once he hits the Enrage, he gets additional ability and accuracy. And then he, like, glances everything, man. So, yeah, it's going to be a lot harder to deal damage to him uh, in about 10 seconds' time. So, yeah, I just, just remembered that as well. I think it's, like, close to impossible to crit him uh, once he Enrages. But yeah, we've we've we met the goal, and now we'll just get the additional damage. Because again, even if we're not critting, dude, we're still doing like a 10k per combo, something like that. Oh no, dude, we're still critting. Okay. I, I don't know how like how he just immediately blocked that. Yeah, I th I thought I uh, thought I lined that up perfectly, but I guess not. Okay, we we still met the target, so. We'll take it, lads. We'll take it. <laughs> right, let's go for 14 of these. Um, and then I'm going to quickly go back and claim some potions here. I'm going to see how much I've got in my stash. I might actually need to open a few more crystals as well. Just very quickly. What are we on? Do I have many? Okay, actually, I didn't have any left in there. So, yeah, I think we uh, go for... Some more crystals. I opened all of my cavaliers yesterday, so I got the Thronebreaker ones now. But these ones are these ones are a little bit bigger, man. They're a little bit more juicy. Should tie us over for the rest of the uh, run here. So yeah, I think we'll go for a stack of um, a hundred, I think, because we are going to need uh, more of these for various challenges. But yeah, to be fair, that's a stack of ninety is fine for now. And let's uh, let's crack on, shall we? And let's go for this. We've actually got so many of these. So yeah, we probably want to use these first, actually. Let's go for three of them. Maybe two and uh, some smaller potions would be more efficient next time. Uh, right, let's jump in. Okay, special three first. Then special two. Who's cheers for a modern chat today, man. I really appreciate it. I appreciate you looking out for the uh, the O Canada live stream, man. Absolute champion, mate. Okay, so if we could get him uh, about 30% here, that would be magical for the finish. But anything like below 35 is good. Uh, good track for the final takedown. Cool. Additional opening. <laughs> yeah, free crystal opening. It's not the most exciting one, is it, man? It's no six-star Doctor Doos in those crystals, unfortunately. I wish there was, though, man. That'd be great. It'd be excellent. I think one thing that's really helping here, I think Sabertooth has got some pretty good crit chance on his base in comparison to Star-Lord. I think, anyway. It's a little bit higher. We've got some crit synergies as well. I think we've got like one or two crit nodes in the Canada team. I think actually might only be one. But yeah, I just feel like we're seeing like a healthy amount of crits on this fight. Not on that special two, unfortunately. Got this man down to 35% here. Again, I want to get him a little bit lower, ideally. If we get him to 25, that would just line up a really, really nice finish. Into a quick assassin's range. Yeah, I swear, like, maybe it's just Star-Lord that just can't grip this man. Maybe it's Aegon. <laughs> 
Yeah, Sabertooth's having no problem critting uh, on the rage here, dude. He's big chilling. Magical. Yeah, we can get this man down a bit more. I want to stop about 15% just to make sure i got plenty of time to build up to my SP3. But I think that's where it's about to stop anyway. So I think we'll go another 5 combo. And then a special 2. And then I'll just I'll just get wrecked, man. Perfect. Because we need uh, another special 3. Get back up to 5 persistent charges. Um... So we can continue our, our Sabertooth adventure and we don't need to ramp him up again. Because if we ramp him up again, it's going to be a few hundred units ideally we would like to avoid using. Right, we shouldn't need him fully, fully topped up. So yeah, that should be good. I think the health booster has just expired here as well, but that's not a problem. Yeah, Ant-Man, like, honestly, dude, I thought this guy was going to take hours to do, but he's he's gone down, like, at a really good pace today. So, yeah, none of the fights so far have been, like, as bad as I expected them to be. We've still got, like, some slightly annoying fights coming up, dude, like, Venom's, Venom's a bit of a pain. Um, and then we've got Maestro, dude. Maestro's a, more than a bit of a pain. <laughs> so, yeah, that should, uh, should be an experience. Just need to try and not fail too much to uh, evading Maestro's special one today. So yeah, when I get in the zone with three-star champion gameplay videos, I can usually do it quite well. But I'm probably going to get clipped quite a, quite a few times, I would imagine, today. But where possible, we're going to try and push him to his uh, special two. Well, there we go. Ant-Man is down. 53 hits. And let's move on. I believe we got Deadable next. Deadable should be a really... Oh, no, no. It's Deadpool X-Force. Yes, of course. How could I forget about this uh, fantastic fight here? Um, Power gain. We need to be careful of the power gain. The power gain is a bit of a, a, bit of a trap sometimes if we get distracted. A couple of years ago, when you first... Um, what was it when Labyrinth was first done? It was, uh, yeah, it was. It was pretty much all four stars. Like a lot of people were doing it with four star Star Lord. <laughs> but then uh, what was it eight? I, I think the Aegon four star clears man were so smooth a couple of years ago for uh, the current state of the game. Those are pretty impressive. But that's just because Aegon was like ridiculously overpowered. Even, even the four star had all of the source needed to smash out the labyrinth. But four star abyss clears, bro. That's that's where the real challenge is at. God, the next um, the next series of these are probably gonna have some sort of abyss related challenges, man, and they're gonna be they're gonna be nuts. I hope I hope they focus more on like doing fun challenges in Act Five, Act Six. Maybe like summon act four as well, like a two star maestro challenge that you can only use like two star. I don't know, like Cyclops or something. <laughs> Cause that dude killing like that freaking maestro with two star champions is actually like a little, a little bit tricky to deal with. So yeah, I think that would be a fun challenge. If I was to design, I'll just add another challenge to the list. Give, give some good rewards. I think that one's good. It's entirely skill based. Just, yeah. A bit tricky to uh, pull off. Okay, right. First try, we are 
aiming for just below 50% here. 40% would be great if we could smash that. We're getting some fantastic aggressive plays here as well. Oh, dude, that was a mega crit. Yeah, Saber Tooth is eating good here, man. He's eating good. He's feasting on these crits, mate. Some fat ones. I wonder if I can, like, trigger the power game this run. Maybe. So if I can trigger it, like, right as I'm about to die, that'd be perfect. Come on, dude. Come on. Fantastic. And I do need to worry about it next time. No! Okay, right, we, we're chilling. We're chilling. Oh, mate, so close. Uh, right, it's actually like mad risky now to... Um, I'm, I'm going to use Old Man Logan just to like push a few percent here, I think. <laughs> Uh, because I don't want to, like, lose the charge if there's some sort of, like, really awkward timing with the power gain. So, yeah, I think I can push, uh, what is it, 60,000? 60, 60,000 here, all I need to do? Yeah, we can do that, dude. Old Man Logan's a beast. And then we'll bring in Sabertooth just for a nice safe takedown. The last bit. Right, let's go for it, mate. That's C32%. Fantastic. Look at those crit bleeds, man. Old man Logan. Old man Logan actually doing work here, dude. It's only rank three. This man's popping off. These goddamn Canadians, bro. What are they feeding them over there? What have they put in the maple syrup? Yeah, that was that was oddly uh oddly great, dude. That worked out really nice. Let's get to like 29%. Cool. Pancakes, though, bro. Damn. God damn. Right. Fantastic. We're done. Let's go back to Saber 2 Fear. Chuck on a uh, revive. But that's still a great uh, send on Deadpool for the first run. Uh, but Old Man Logan, he, he served well. He served us very, very well there. Proud of his, uh, proud of his efforts. Right. <clears throat> We got this man. The final rally with Sabretooth. And then on to uh on to Daredevil. Daredevil should be a cool match. I think if we had spare attack boosters, I think there is potential to um a one-shot Daredevil, maybe. <laughs> if you if he played like perfectly into you. But uh yeah, but you have to have attack boosters, I would assume. Just need a little bit more damage. Okay, nice. We got our persistent charge here. Perfect. And then we just need to finish the fight after this. That Canadian bacon be supercharging. It really is, mate. It really is. It means we can actually uh, use Old Man Logan for uh, Maestro if needed. Which is uh, interesting to think about. But hopefully we don't need to use Old Man Logan for Maestro because we don't die with Sabertooth. Five times. But it could, it could all go very, very, very wrong at Maestro. But hopefully it's not going to. Oh, no. You got that evade, bro. Get in the bin. And yeah, you definitely don't want to use Guardian for Maestro. Because the really annoying thing, again, he's got like uh, enigmatic abilities. Depending on the class that you're playing uh, 
against him. Like Mutant I and Cosmic Champions, I think are the easiest versus Maestro. So yeah, Medusa and Sabretooth clutch for the uh, Inhuman and Canadian runs. Then Star Lord. Ah, Star Lord's annoying, dude. Because again, he can just like start healing up like crazy. So yeah, the Star Lord run is going to be mad painful. It's been about two hours and uh, what is it, twenty six minutes so far. We have uh, chilled at certain points though, but it hasn't been too bad. Um, right, let's go for it. Aiming for just a clean, like, over 50%, anything over 50%. It's going to be uh, satisfactory here. If we get one shot, that'd be amazing. I don't think we got uh, quite enough output to uh, get the one shot before the, uh, I think it's like three minute four star enrage. Let's make sure we go for a special three here. Right, nice, we got the charge in the bank. That's always good. What is the reward for this madness he's doing? Well, it's one out of nine to the the, the main end game reward, but this one is like gives you a six star Nexus crystal. Um I think some tier four but is oh no, it's I think it's four tier two alpha as well. But yeah, the main big reward is like a little bit of uh tier six basic, a little bit of tier three alpha. Uh, a fully formed T5CC selector and 60 generic six star stones. So yeah, there's there's like a, a pretty juicy stack of stuff, man. But the labyrinth ones, I think, are uh, all by far the most time consuming ones to do. Oh, okay, has he got like auto evade for the special two? I think he does. So yeah, I think we just don't use any special attacks. Just hold on the special three. Actually, we can use the special three. That's any reason not to. Yeah, it's not like we're trying to save it, so we might as well just dump it for like 2% damage when we can. It's just like free 2% damage. Which is uh, it's a great deal, man. Good deal. We'll go for a 5 combo straight into this. Yo, what is up, Prison Mike? Thank you very much for the two euro super chat. All right, sorted. Love your content. Thank you very much, Prison Mike. I appreciate that. Love your profile picture. Looking, looking incredibly handsome. Looking a little bit like Steve Carell out of the office, mate. I must admit. You, uh, you bear a striking, uh, striking resemblance. Not too sure if he's like a long lost cousin or close relative, but yeah, it's really weird. Come on, fella. Come on. Oh, no. I shouldn't have gone for special two. I'm dumb. I'm actually dumb. Just thinking damage, stonks, numbers. Big PP numbers. But no. I'm actually a mug. It's really unfortunate. Oh, yes. <laughs> Dude, these are these unblockable hits. Just they feel good. They feel really good. I'm so glad. Yeah, definitely, definitely bring in old man Logan just just for the synergy, man. Maybe take like five percent health off one fight. But old man Logan, he's just he's pure stonks. Right, let's chuck this off, mate. Get it. Get air butted, get wrecked. Oh no. <laughs> uh, okay, we're going down 50%, man. Alright, let's see what we can do here. And let's uh, crack on for the next try. We need a good run here um, and not getting smacked in the face. And we can get him down uh, with what we have remaining. So, yeah, no special twos on this fight. I'm actually going to, like, get myself fully topped up here. Because it will be a little bit close on the uh, the final enrage. But you can get off the remaining uh, chunk, I'm confident. Okay. 
If you're super quick, you can go for like a four combo and then five combo out of the game. I'm, I'm just playing it safe, man. Those stuns, they have some really good duration. Okay, that's fantastic. Alright, cool. We've had a really good uh, run-up to this so far. Taking off a solid 10%. And we are um, not too far now from getting this man into Assassin's range. And once we do, then we can go even harder here. Okay, special two bad. Don't press special two. Easy, mate. Easy. Look at that. That's that's what we call discipline, boys. Discipline. Cool. Smack this man. Kick him over. Where's the rock? There it is, mate. Myself a bit open there, but we had a uh, we had a good recovery. Right, is this man gonna throw a special? Perfect. Go for this, then special three. This one's gonna be a little bit, a little bit close. I think we can do it. Takes him down to almost seven percent there. That. Actually, he's not on final rage yet, so we're all right. Just need to stay in the game. I think we'll be fine throwing a special one. Oh, no, he got Labyrinth of Eight. No, dude, no. Oh, that is unfortunate, mate. That's unfortunate. Damn, bro. Right, I'm bringing out, uh, bringing out Wolverine to finish this one up, mate. We'll go for it. Let's revive this man back from the dead again. I don't want to use Sabertooth because I can't get Special 3 and thus I can't get the Persistent Charge. Yeah, that was just really unlucky there, man. But Wolverine, uh, Wolverine nice clean up here. And then we've got, uh, we've got Venom up next, dude. Right? Yeah, Venom. Oh, Venom's going to be a bit of a pain. Oh, I've had good times against this Venom, and I've had bad times against this Venom. It depends how much he wants to throw his special one today, but let's definitely avoid X-23. If we accidentally went X-23, the run would have been immediately over. But now we can make no more mistakes on the path itself, which is good. Um, how long do we have left on the boosters here? We're like two and a half hours, dude. Oh my goodness. I gotta get my car uh, booked in for service at one. So I got 50 minutes to finish this off. Damn, bro. I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to go saying. Alright, what's on our booster again? 25 minutes. One more of these, I think. Right, let's go for it. Come on. Just need a good run against Venom here. Sorry I'm late for my service, sir. I do apologize. I was uh, I was in, you see, Labyrinth of Legends. I was in Labyrinth of Legends, and I could only use Canadian characters. If they let me use my main roster, I would have been done easy. But the fact I have to use only Canadian characters, gosh. 
soaked up my morning. Okay, nice. We got the charge here. <laughs> it's a bit too focused on uh, messing about at the start of that one. But let's let's go for it, man. We got saber tooth. We got a dream. So need to refill my uh, water in a moment as well. Got to stay hydrated, boys. for a fade there. Okay, right. What's up next, mate? Come on. Yes. Go on. We love a Venom that throws a special one. No! Oh, we got him down 25%. Uh, that was alright with the mistakes made there. But let's uh, let's get back into business here. Again, Venom's, uh, Venom's a bit annoying, man. <laughs> uh, we did we did leave ourselves a bit too open there as well. So it's uh, it's definitely definitely on me for not having a slightly better try. 25% I think is the, the goal here per revive. Use three revives to get him down, mate. That would be fantastic. Right, nice, dude. That was a good, good start against Venom this time. He is playing super aggressive, so yeah, hopefully it stays like that.
Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go, man. Let's go. That was sick. We got 51% that try, man. That was awesome. That was really, really nice. Uh, okay, we just need to focus up one final try, man. We've got him in really, really good range there. Uh, yeah, we were, we were doing well. Oh, <laughs> feel a bit sweaty after that one, man. Venom is still like, he's such an old character, but he still feels like so good to fight. Because he's, uh, he's just like so aggressive and scary, man. So it feels good like once you get on top of the fight. Um, and are just dodging him and just like finesse and everything. Oh, uh, no, no, no. He just evaded into like, oh, God. Such a large portion of a combo there. Okay, I've got to be super safe here. Right, hopefully this doesn't push him uh, special two, but if it does, we got the persistent charge. Um, hopefully he's like just below it. Okay, nice, that's perfect. Right, nice man, nice. That was only two revives on Venom. That middle try was sick. That was a little bit um, uh, shaky toward the start, but I think we came uh, back really, really well there. Okay, so we got three more bosses left. Right, I need a quick break uh, just to get some more water. Um, so yeah, be right back, guys. Give me uh, three minutes.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We've got a bottle of water, but bottle of water, a glass of water. <laughs> Sorry, Poos was uh, taking the piss in chat, mate, and it just uh, it stuck inside me head. Uh, right, what do we have here in terms of the boost there? We've got 13 minutes remaining, so let's go for uh, three of these bad boys. And, um, yeah, a couple of these as well. But we need uh, some good runs on Iron Fist here. If we're super lucky, I think Iron Fist is a fight we can one revive. But again, we just need uh, to play well and the evades to be in our favor here. And then we've got Civil Warrior. Civil Warrior is probably going to be a bit of a pain, actually. He, he should be alright, though. I think he's just going to be like more. Uh, a long fight <laughs> than anything else, just because of the uh, uh, disadvantage. So yeah, that's probably like two, three revives there. Is this the most fun I've had in a while? I've, I've enjoyed this round today, man. I had uh, I had a lot of fun on yesterday's challenges. So yeah, most fun I've had in a while. I don't know, dude. I've had a lot of, a lot of fun recently, man. So it's tough to say. I have, I have enjoyed, uh, <laughs> I've, I've enjoyed this run actually, it hasn't been too bad. Sabretooth has just been, wow, he's just surpassed like all of my expectations, man. It's been fantastic today. Living up, living up to that solid god tier ranking. Look, after, after the O Canada challenge, man, nobody's, nobody's down Sabretooth anymore. It's the big Canada carrier here. Dodge that one at the right time, so I was trying to read chat, but I should not try and read chat. I should try and focus on not dying. Yes, that would be ideal. Those Thronebreaker Daily Crystals, though, having like so many 5k potions in, mad clutch, dude. Mad, mad clutch. We should have tried to uh, go for opening some of those earlier. Okay, 50% is the target. If we drill this man down to about 40% though, that'd be fantastic. But yeah, let's go. Oh no, dude, that's so unlucky, man. Oh, that is well annoying, mate. That is well annoying. Okay, the the good thing is, um, we got we we like pretty much met the target, so <laughs> it means that we we can fit if we have a phenomenal run here, we can finish. But that was just like just clown fiesta, bro. We just got mad clown fiesta there. How many revives so far? I haven't actually been keeping track. Um, yeah, I actually don't know. I think like 30 maybe? I think. So most fights have been done in like one to four revives. I think Magic maybe took like five. Yeah, I think aside from that, everything's been like one to four. Okay, Iron Fist is super passive there, dude. We lost time. Time that we don't have. want to get him down in this one. Alright, let's smash this out. In Texas at 6am. Fair play. Damien, thank you very much for tuning in, man. I'm enjoying uh, Season 5 of 7 BS, dude. It's been, uh, been pretty, pretty spicy. To the, uh, the person that asked in chat there. So much great anime knocking about at the moment. My parry times just screwed. Yeah, I think they were for a sec. 
You have parries, but they weren't landing, but I think the timing was just off. Okay, come on. I'm gonna try and get this man down and down 50% before the sorry, 15% before the uh, second enrage kicks in. Like a minute to do so. Let's play mad aggressive here. And hope uh, Iron Fist throws those specials, bro. Come on. Let's see how yeah, come on, special two, fella, special two. Special two. Oh my god, this is going to be so tight. Come on, big crit. Okay, no crit. <laughs> Gee, is currently not working in our favour here. Oh, didn't even play into the backdraft. How many hells are we going to take on this fight, man? Okay, right, come on, big crit on the final hit. Okay, we're slightly, slightly back on track now. Final Enrage goes very quick, though. One more combo should do. Please don't evade. <laughs> nice, man. Nice. So one revive on Iron Fist there. Uh, perfect. But yeah, we started this uh, stream today with... Uh, I think it's about just over 12k units. And now we've got... Uh, uh, 10... Uh, 10,000... 600. But also, like, I've brought some revives and potions that I haven't used it yet. And also, we did start with... Uh, uh, a few additional things in the stash. So yeah, I have uh, actually quite a big stack of Cavalier uh, Throne Breaker Crystals. We use like a few of those. I still got like 300 left though. Daily ones. Okay, nice dude. If we're still critting like friggin' 8k mediums on this fight. Really? No, dude. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Fuck you, Civil Warrior, you dickhead. He just... Ugh. Fuck. Fuck this man. I'm not happy, mate. I'm not happy about that. Guys, what the... What a twat, mate. Fuck you. You absolute piece of shit. Your rework's trash, bro. You need to hold block too much. Yeah, your fury duration sucks. Said it, you fucking pussy. <laughs> oh, I'm so annoyed. Oh, mate. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was some of the worst Labyrinth RNG I've ever seen in the history of Labyrinth. Oh, my God. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, we just got like it's got it's got clown there bro we just got clown chat's going mad guys i i'm glad i'm glad some of you enjoyed that i'm glad you had a proper good time there <laughs> uh, look john you have a scenario like that bro you are you're letting out the bombs bro the bombs are the bombs are flying off the handlebars. <laughs> uh. And contextually, I did not say I was uh, unopposed to swear, and I said I'm saving it for the right time and scenario. And that, my friend, <laughs> was the right time and scenario. Uh. Oh my god. Well, now we know, boys. Now we know. Thank you for the, the soup chats as well. Mad love to TF review. Oh my god, he evaded again. Okay, guys, I'm, I'm so sorry. I can't pay too much attention to the chat. I've got to gotta keep my head in the game. Or else this man is, is going to clown me again. Let's see if we can get him, like, 45%. That'd be perfect. Come on. 
come on, mate. I need that special to throw it. Look. Oh, no, that's bad. That's really bad. Fuck you! <laughs> no, he just evaded straight into a combo. That heavy attack, getting clipped by that was 100% on me. Uh, but yeah, what a, what a dick, mate. What a dick. Oh, yo, what is up, uh, C-Bite as well? Just rank five, my first five-star Cosmic Ghost Rider. Congratulations. <sighs> I hate the Labyrinth of Legends, bro. It's going to be even more painful when we do this for Star-Lord, because if we lose the combo... Again, we got build up the damage, dude. And that is... That's not going to be fun, man. That's not going to be fun. <laughs> okay, um... Let's let's get back in it. Positive thoughts only, guys. It's about your state of mind, and we are nothing but perfect intercepts and a lack of uh, getting clapped by certain com. Okay, calm down, fella. Calm down. Calm down. The age-old saying, when the bubble pops, Civil Warrior drops. That's how you... That's how you fight Civil Warrior, mate. That's how you learn that special one-timing. Oh, <laughs> strongest lab champion, Evade Man. Dude, Evade Man. Evade Man's ridiculous, mate. Uh, yes, Chris Tackett. Yes, yes. This man knows when the bubble pops, Civil Warrior drops. Which basically means, for any of you who might be learning how to fight Civil Warrior, as soon as you see the pop, then you, you go in and punish. Oh, nice. 40k. Let's slam it down, Sabretooth. Let's show this man some numbers. Okay, I've got 28 minutes till I need to put my car in for <laughs> service. It's like two minutes away. I can be about 10 minutes late, I think, before I get in big trouble. I think we've got time for Maestro. Just need to stop getting clowned on by this man. I've got to go AFK. I've got to go AFK. Yeah, if, if you are enjoying today's stream filled with Civil Warrior evading me, um, please do smash that like button. Always appreciate it. Come on, let's go, mate. Let's go. That was, that was phenomenal, man. That was really, really good. Um, I still need to leave like a little bit of uh, health. I, I think we get to 15%. That's fine as well. Because, yeah, I still need to get into the fight. Special 3. And then um, uh, do that to m maintain my persistent charges. So, yeah, let's go for a uh, level 2 or 5. Let's heal up and let's get going. Yo, Michael, thank you very much. Raydron, bro, it's good to see. It's not just me gets frustrated. <laughs> Cheers from the north. Don't worry, mate. We all we all have those times where, especially Labyrinth as well, dude, there's just like, uh, there's there's some clown, there's some clown town stuff that goes on here. I think my 30% boost has actually expired, so let's chuck that back on again. I was like, yeah, I'm healing up a bit too, uh, a bit too easily here. Okay, where is it? Booster, fantastic. And let's, um, yeah, let's just go for it. We should be fine with what we got left here. Again, we're about to enter Assassin's range as well.
Right, let's get our special three. We got the persistent charge secured. Now we just need to finish it this time. Super, super close. Please, no Clown Town evades. Thank you very much, game. Be nice to me. Been nothing but sweet and so kind to Civil Warrior today, man. I said a bad word about this, man. Do you want to want to use that special too, mate? Oh, fantastic! Cheers. Five more percent, come on. Let's get some uh, good good RNG with the evades. One more special two. Double medium, both connected. Okay, perfect mate, perfect. Right, it's maestro time, boys. Let's see if we can uh, demolish this man in, <laughs> yeah, like uh, 23 minutes. Fingers crossed. Um. But yeah, maybe warm up try with uh, Wolverine just to get into the uh, special one fading habits. And then we'll uh, go with Sabertooth. Solo with Wolverine, bro. Let's go. I'm here for it, man. <laughs> no. Okay, I got clown there. Better to get clowned on Wolverine than Sabertooth for sure, man. A hundred percent. But anyway, let's get the boy uh let's get the boy topped up. Um oh my I have those, okay. Right, let's go for uh, let's go for some of these then. And then yeah, hopefully we can have some good runs here. Let me just double check the boosters. Right, we should be good to go. Oh, let's see what we can do here. We're gonna hold one percent off. Right, let's go for it. Oh no, dude! We got so clowned there, man. We got so clowned. That was ridiculous. Oh, okay. At least, like, that, that wasn't bad um, until the end. He just evaded straight into special one. There's nothing I could do there, man. Oh my god. Okay, right. Let's, uh, let's go for one of these bad boys. Um, and then let's go for... 
a few of these. I'm actually going to need to open... I'll, I'm going to do this really quickly. I'm going to need to uh, open some Thronebreaker crystals. But yeah, try and get some more of these 5k potions, dude. Actually, I might have like a few of my stash I can claim here. Oh yeah, I've got so many of these uh, level 3 ones. So yeah, actually, I think we'll just go for those. Uh, and we should be fine. Let's jump back in. But that was, that was alright for a first try, man. It was alright for a first try. But let's, uh, let's go for it, mate. Okay, and I think if we're really lucky, we can get about 20% off in a good run. Crit RNG that time was like absolutely phenomenal, man. It was so good. Okay, right, we got the persistent charge back. That's fantastic. Let's go in for a three combo. Right. Um. Why is that frozen? Okay, my entire game froze, but it looks like we're back now. That was really, really weird. Okay, we got a little bit clipped. It's fine. Still recover. No, 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 no! Oh my god! Oh, yeah, I was just thrown off there. All right, let's jump back in again. Uh, let's go for. Uh, we are going for the wrong character there. And then let's go for a 10k <laughs> and a 5k. That a good, that a good start, but yeah, I just I muffled it at the end, man. He just clipped me a couple of times. I wasn't quick enough on a couple of the evades there, but that was oh, that was lined up to be a really promising run. But again, as long as we can get the uh, persistent charge, it's kind of the main thing we need. <laughs> right, I reacted to that bait so quickly. That was really good. Worked out nicely. Right, let's go for it. We are... We're smashing it now, boys. We're smashing it. This man's going straight in the bin. I want to try and see if I can survive till final enrage on one of these attempts. But 10% per try, I think, is uh, what we're going for. Oh, that's so fortunate. Okay, big crit. Oh, no crit, man. Unlucky, lads. Unlucky.
Damn! Good try, man. Good try. Got clipped. He was about to enrage anyway. Uh, so not too much of an issue there. Uh, <laughs> but let's go again. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, the that. Uh, there's something about Maestro that's uh, always like a little bit nerve-wracking, but also very exciting to fight at the same time. So yeah, love love fighting this man. Okay, we're we're, we're making like good time for getting the the car checked in as well. I'm gonna literally need to like run after this stream though, lads. Assuming I don't get massively, massively wrecked here, so I need to play well. Just 10 minutes of playing well, dude. That's all we need. Oh, no! Oh, okay, okay, right, right. Let's stabilize. Okay, should be good. We got a bit finesse there. I think by an evade, uh, it all happened so quickly. <laughs> I think this hopefully should get him. Actually, it might be a little bit below SP2 here, so I'm going to try and bait out heavy. Oh, really, dude? I just got absolutely cucked there, man. That is... That's just BS, bro. Oh, my God. At least you got the special three off and got the charge, but there's, a, like, a vague special one, bro. It's like, goodbye. <laughs> that 1% of evade, man. Oh, what a dick. Uh, right, let's... Uh... <laughs> let's uh, let's move, move on, shall we? Uh, next, uh, next try. Okay, good. We're all good for boosters. We just need to keep on melting this man. Right, we should be good there. Not today, bitch! <laughs> uh, there we go. Reacted to that one, man. I just about saw that. Oh, fantastic.
Oh, mate, mate. Oh, a little bit off time there. Right, come on, lads. We can still do it. I've got nine minutes to get this man down and leg it to the garage. <laughs> uh, should have started the stream, like, uh, a little bit earlier, man. Right, let's do it, mate. Let's do it. We still got persistent charges for days. We're doing well. Okay, cool. 38%. We're getting close now to Assassin's Range, man. We just need one really good run here. And then we can just uh, murder into it for a couple of uh, final tries. Oh, no. Okay, at least we got the persistent charge this run. Gonna chuck all the damage I can, <laughs> and there we go. Yeah, we're, di we're dipping. Oh, we we're still kind of alive here, man. Unexpected. We're only gonna be alive for like a few seconds though, because yeah, the poison's about to be us. Oh, a little bit unfortunate with that. Slightly mistimed the evade there. Um, let's go though. Gonna buy like a few more of those because we might need them. And let's go for this. And then let's jump back in. 35%. He's a big old chunky boy to try and hack down still. Definitely takes his uh his time. Okay, amazing. Right, so I say to the garage, sorry I'm a little bit late. I was in a work meeting and my boss, my boss is a dick, dude. He wouldn't let me leave early. I can't tell them that I was in the labyrinth of legends of Canadian champions, bro. I think, I think I'll need to be sectioned. <laughs> Unless... We get some super lucky. We get super lucky with a guy that plays MCOC and it's like, oh, dude, you're in Labyrinth with for Canadian champions, bro? I understand, man. I'd be a little bit late if I was as well. You know, I went in there the other day with Aegon, bro. That took me time, but Canadian champions, bro? I would have been there the whole week. <laughs> but I hope the boss doesn't see that. <laughs> oh, Self-employed, man. Self-employed. Worst boss in the world. Oh, no. Damn it, bro. Damn it. Okay, right. Oh, my ghetto's crashed as well. That is a pain, man. That is a pain. Oh, no. This is not the time for the Elgato to crash. Elgato, come back. Please. Please. <laughs> no! Come on, please. Please be alive. Oh, gosh, no. What's well, It's not working. Um, right, uh, one second, lads, one second. 
Mate, this is like the worst time to have technical difficulties right now. I'm already running late, mate. I'm not in a... <sighs> Life, eh, lads? What is it like? What is it like? Okay, nice. We're back. We're back. Got it working again. Let's go. Toggle full screen. We're ready to go. Right, come on. Uh, let's see what we can do. <laughs> We're almost in Assassin's range as well, man. Super, super close there. So yeah, we're about to get that, that big source damage. Right, 23%. Let's go, Sabertooth. Let's go. You've got this, bro. Straight into a special two. Right, I think that was maybe the best to go for, just to push him to a special two. <laughs> because evading the special one's a little bit a little bit sketchy sometimes. Yo, what's up? The boy Legacy. Hopefully you're doing well, mate. You've uh, you've come at the right time, my friend. Well that we're on the home stretch right now. No, my game's lagged. My game's actually frozen on my device. Okay, okay, we're back. We're back. Okay, nice. We got another... Oh, again, the, the dash in, dude. Oh, my goodness, dude. Uh, yeah, that was that, like, actually frozen on my screen as well, dude. Not a good time for it, lads. Not a good time for it. Come on. Not long to eat some rage now. Making sure everything's good on the uh, the playback here. Oh, I can't believe we recovered both of those though. That is good. That's really good. Okay, he's about to enrage. We we get what we can. Go for this. Should we have to get another combo? Then straight into a special one. Fantastic. Right, that's all we're getting out of that, man. 10% to go, dude. So close here, man. If we get if we get fortunate here, it's one more run, and this man's in the bin. So yeah, we just need a little bit of a little bit of good RNG. 
Uh, I think we're kind of at the point. We've got four persistent charges. Don't need to worry about special three, man. Let's just go special two. Let's, uh, let's forget about that one, boys, okay? Look, nobody saw that. It was... It never happened. It never happened at all. Just, uh... Just edit... <laughs> edit that one out, man. Edit that one out. Oh, God. So I can't edit out. It's a live stream now, bro. Okay, well, we got down 2% there. So that is, you know, that's the outcome of that one. Okay, right, come on, this has got to be it, mate. Am I going too hard here? Come on, there we go. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. O Canada, Labyrinth of Legends with only four star Canadian champions. It feels good, man. I have to shoot off really, really quickly. Thank you all so much for watching today's live stream, man. Uh, and if you did enjoy the stream, please do smash that like button. That'd be greatly appreciate it. Uh, but also, just double check that we have uh, successfully done it. There we go, man. We are now four out of nine. We got the Nexus Crystal. We're going to be saving up for a big... Um, uh, Karina Challenge Crystal Opening. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching today's live stream. Uh, take care, and I hope that you have an absolutely fantastic day. And I will just wait a second to make sure the stream ends at the right point. But yeah, cheers, everybody.